Hi everyone, welcome back to the Scottish Cowboys Darts channel. Today we're going to be having a look at a set of Mission Fion darts. As you can hear, I've got a bit of sore throat, so I'm going to crack on and do this review as quickly as possible. No me, that'll be 25 minutes. Before we do the review, I'd just like to give a thanks to Neil's Darts. If you're not a subscriber to Neil's Darts, please check him out. His reviews are top notch. He gave me these to review. That's his little logo up there. Check him out. Subscribe. Get his notifications. But for now, let's get these over the table. Then get him to the throne section. Then get back here for the ratings and a recap. <laughs> First look at the box, it's just a standard mission box, you get the name Fion on the outside, the mission logo, nice little designs on the outside, kind of sci-fi looking design, you've got a clear window with the barrel, the stem and the flights, telling you here it's 24 grams and it's match weight 2.05 of a gram. On the side of the box, you've got the Fion and mission. On the other side, the exact same. So for these people that stack them on shelves, you get to see what darts are. A little a bit of information about Mission. You could pause the video and read that if you want to. Mission darts are supplied with Mission grip lock shafts, Mission S lock rings, and Mission 100 micron flights. Again, telling you its match weight is 0.05 of a gram. A little safety warning is telling you not to leave kids unsupervised as darts in different languages. A little web address for them if you want to look up and get some darts but these darts were given to me by Neil's darts but they are available to purchase from darts corner they come in three different weights they are 22 grams 24 grams and 26 grams they are 57 pounds and 95 pence the dimensions for the 22 grams would be 6.5 diameter by 48 millimeters long the 24 would be 6.8mm diameter by 48 long and the 26 gram is 7mm diameter by 48 longs. So they're only jumping up in diameter. They're not jumping up in length at all. These darts, every set is 48mm long. So let's crack open and have a look at the darts. So as with all mission, they come in the little plastic velvety coated case. It holds them in position, but that's all it does. It's, in my opinion, they could do better on the packaging a little bit. So, what we'll do is we'll have a look at this flight because I actually like it. Now, in my crazy head, that looks like something out of a Star Wars movie. It looks like it's little eyes. That's its big nose and that's its horns. It's just me. I've got a crazy imagination. It's just, it looks a bit like a Taurus, the bull sign as well. So, it's actually a nice looking flight. That'll look nice on the board. Only when I put it on a dart though. So, the barrels. Let's have a look at the barrels. So, here we go. As you can see, it comes with a black point. Always a plus mark with me with black points. The front of the barrel is a bull nose. Then you get what you can only be described as a lot of detail. Firstly, each section is repeated. So you get a straight cut ring. But in this black bit of the ring, it is also cut further in. As you can see. Then you get to the first raised part. And it's got some amount of milling in it it's absolutely unbelievable detail now when i'm holding that for grip that is a real good grip real good so that is just repeated all the way up the barrel until you get to the rear section where you've just got the mission logo on the smooth section with a bit of taper towards the stem so we'll get the stem we'll give it a measure it's a short stem it's no doubt about it, it's a short stem. Thirty four point four. So short stem. As it said the barrel is meant to be forty eight millimeters, so we'll check that just now. Forty eight 
48.2, nothing wrong with that. And the diameter, these are the 24, so it should be 6.8. 6.7, 6.7, 6.8. It will depend if you catch the raised section the right way. So 6.7, that's fine. So, all in all, the dart's looking really, really good. I really like that. It's like a copper looking effect. Inlay, it's really nice. There's a lot of work on it in this dart. Definitely a lot of work. A really good feeling grip. I'm going to give that grip about 3.5 to a 4 at the moment before I even threw it. So, guys, let's get these darts weighed, get a close-up of them, and then get them over to the board. Got the scale set up, and to date, I have still not found a perfectly matched weight of darts. I'm sure I've not. I've had ones that have been very, very close, but not one that's much. So, let's see what these are. Let's start with the first dart. 24.04 and 24.07 So they're all plus or minus 0 0.05 So they're in tolerance, so that's a win-win they're not perfectly matched weight. I'm still looking for that perfect set of darts. Full set up. 25.62. So let's get the close up done. Then get them over to the board. So here we have the point. Of a dart. Leading up. To that fine intricate detail on the barrel just look at how many grooves and how many different variations and heights there is in each section there that continues all the way up the barrel then you get to the grip lock stem then finally that really nice flight darts up they feel quite short to be honest I would probably extend the stem to a medium but as we're doing this on bot supplied let's have a little throw and here we go well they're good on the ones as you can see they're leaning slightly to the left which happens sometimes when we so I'm imagining these are a number six flight and not number two. But they're going on the board really nice. They're going through the air really nice, which when we're doing these reviews, we're not really looking at how we're scoring because it's your first throw with a set of darts. You normally use a different set of darts. You're talking or you're playing, it's just how they're going into the board and they're going into the board really, really nice so I'm going to have one more throw in the 20s then I'll do the 19s, the bull then straight on to the school of the challenge
lights, top down, skylights, the canvas wide open, yeah. Red shoes, gold chains, big hair, valet, the cameras are rolling. Uh, one shot, one dream, six hearts, one team. Cause we walk to the streets when we hit it to the beat on the Hollywood scene, scene. If you don't make it out to the party, don't stress, we can make it hotty. Turn, turn that music up, turn, turn that music up. One dream, six hearts, one team. Cause we walk to the streets when we hit it to the beat on the Hollywood scene. scene. If you don't make it out to the party, don't stress, we can make it hotty. Turn, turn that music up, turn, turn that music up. Now listen, to everybody. Let's make it tonight. I'm gonna take this town to the circle. Oh, yeah. Let's make it tonight. I'm gonna take this town to the circle. I'm feeling alive, love, love. recap on the mission Feel and Darts. As I said earlier, these are available from Darts Corner. They are £57.95. They come in 22, 24 and 26 grams, so there is a weight for most people out there. It's a really nice straight barrel dart. It's got a real good grip, really good workmanship in it. The workmanship is actually spectacular. Grip rating for this dart is 4 at the front, Four at the middle and four at the rear. I'm not going to take any points off for the smooth bit at the rear because it's a long enough barrel that you could still be gripping on the grip section at the rear of the barrel. Value for money. If the packaging was better, this would probably be a nine and a half out of ten. But the packaging, it's that just a plastic velvet coated dart. You get darts at 20 quid that's got that packaging you'll get darts like unicorn darts at 60 quid that's got the foam insert target darts foam insert perfect nine darts beautiful box so maybe just have a look at the packaging to bring this up for value for money because that's the first thing the customer sees is the packaging and in the 1980s, 85, 90s, 95, that'd be okay, but we've moved on for then. The packaging has got a lot better with other companies, so it's an 8 out of 10. Overall, really nice that. Really nice that. When I first got these to review, I thought, oh, these are not going to be a good dart. I don't know if I like these. But that's the point of reviews, because I really like these. This is getting an overall of 8.5 out of 10, which is a really good mark for these darts. It's an 8.5 out of 10. As you can see, when I done the throne section, I was, wasn't getting anywhere near 20. I had more 1s and 5s. But the more I threw them, and then this is not, there is no editing, no. As soon as I do the throne section, I go on and I do the school of the challenge. I do not have any other attempts. I just do one attempt, attempt. If they do it in 15 darts, they do it in 20 darts, that's what it is. And I've done it in eight darts. So I got a cracking result on the score. I could go and do the score challenge again right now and do it in 15 darts. But they feel good. They're a, they're a cracking balance to these darts. They're, they're probably the best mission dart I've done. Easily. I would say easily the best mission dart I've done. These, as I said, darts corner. I'll put the link in the description when you look at the video. Head over. Purchase them. You won't be, if you like the straight barrel, you like a bit of grip, you won't be disappointed. Don't bother about the short stems, you can put whatever length of stems in it you want, but other side of the flights, you're actually just buying a barrel anyway. So, a real one. Thanks again to Neil's Darts for giving me these darts to review. Legend. Thanks for watching. Please hit the subscribe button. The more people that subscribe, the more content I'll put out. It's just as simple as that. 
There is a competition running that ends tomorrow. I'm uploading this video on a Saturday night. That ends tomorrow. If you check my previous videos, you'll see it. It's for another set of darts. That ends tomorrow. Most of all, before I go, you know what? Keep enjoying your darts, and I'll catch you on the next review.